She's better than me. <laughs> hey everybody, what's up? It's Katie Austin here, and welcome to What's On Your Phone. In this episode, I interview Trevor Baptiste from Atlas, the guy with the most personality. Let's go. What's up guys? I am here with Trevor Baptiste from the Atlas, and we want to look through your phone. All right. I want to see how many contacts you have. So contacts. go to your phone. Okay. Yeah. Contacts. And then go all the way to the end. I didn't even know you could do this. It says two contacts. You definitely don't have two contacts. You have like hundreds. Yes. I think you need to update your phone. <laughs> Wait, why does it say that? I don't know. No new Clearly friends. Clearly Trevor doesn't have any friends. Yeah. So who was the last person you texted? Uh, let's see. Last person I texted was Tucker Durkin. A couple okay. people texted me before that. Actually, no, it was RJ. RJ. It was RJ. Okay. I asked him where we're doing this video, and he said here. So if you go into your text, like press RJ. RJ, yeah. What is your top used emoji? Okay, with RJ or in general? No, in general. So if you go to your oh, yeah, iMessage yeah, 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 yeah. and you press it. Oh, this guy right here. What I is that guy? He's like a detective. I'm going to send it to RJ right now. I don't know, it's kind of like, uh, <laughs> it's kind of like sneaky, like a little sassy in a like, way. What but do at the you same send? time mysterious. Why, why do you send that? Like, if, what RJ, just, a... RJ just asked if I'm good. You good. <laughs> <laughs> if someone's like, oh damn, Trevor, like, you're looking fly in this picture, I'd send that detective emoji, like, you know, like, oh, something like that, or, or like, oh, I wonder what's gonna happen in Game of Thrones tonight, detective emoji. Okay, well, that makes sense. I don't know about the fly. In the yeah, because it's like, oh, like, you're watching like, it. I see yeah, you. Yeah, I see oh, you. Oh, it's know? like, I see you. I see you, or I see you seeing me, you know uh, what I'm saying? <laughs> you know All right, now, what is your top social media app? Oh, Instagram by far. Yeah? Yeah. Love Instagram. One key DM that I got, uh, Mason, Mason Hampshire, um, I think he's a high schooler or middle schooler near me. He made me this, this picture right here. I actually tossed it on my story the other day. Probably one of the coolest DMs I've ever gotten. Um, and like this artwork, it's actually hanging on my refrigerator right now. Something that I'm so proud of that I didn't even do. Uh, wow, it really, Mason. It really made, my, Mason. made yeah. my day, made my year maybe. He's talented too. Really talented, look at this. You see it and like, if you look closely, you know, like it's got like all these different words inside of the drawing. Yeah. And like, even like, like look at those small ones there. Whoa. You know? Like you really got down deep into he it. He really loves you. I mean, I guess, I don't know. I feel like that's your best fan DM, for sure. 100%, yeah. 100%. I probably should've said the detective emoji yeah. back to him. <laughs> It'd be like, like no. I see you. What do you listen to before a game? Like, what's your favorite pump up song? I know it's kind of basic for me to say, but probably sicko mode. Oh, <laughs> like, yeah. I don't know, it just, it, it like never gets old for me, you know? It never Play gets it. old for me. Also a huge Travis Scott fan. Are you good at singing? No, but I can dance, kind of. You wanna dance? Dance. Can you do the one? Go, so you gotta throw it up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. I wish you could stand up to Floss. Floss, do it. I think it'll be good in the video. Floss. Oh! Wait. She's better than me. <laughs> hey, can you do it fast? <laughs> <laughs> okay, now wait, you have a really sick background. Can you explain to me what this is? Yeah, so last fall, I actually went on a trip with Yes Theory. Um, do, you know, do you know what Yes Theory is? No. So Yes Theory is um, this, this group on YouTube, and they're all about seeking discomfort, so putting people outside of their comfort zones. So I told them, I, I had a FaceTime with uh, Amar, he's, he's one of the guys in the group, and, and he was like, uh, like, what are you afraid of? And I, I was like, I, I really don't like turbulence on, on airplanes. So we did a whole day um, where we went to New York City and we rolled a dice, and any number on the dice corresponded to something we had to do. And it was like crazy stuff, like they had to street perform with, for like 15 minutes. And the last thing we did is we went on a helicopter ride over New York City without doors. And we had to find someone who was afraid of heights to come with us. I'm definitely afraid yeah, of heights. Yeah, so, oh, you, you would've been perfect. I would've been perfect. I couldn't do it. It was, but it was awesome, and, and this, this was the background. Uh, that so is kinda, the coolest photo I've ever yeah, seen. So this is, those are actually Amar's feet, and then these are my feet here, and that's Central Park. Shout out to Yes Theory, love those guys. Hi, Amar. Hi, Yes Theory. <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much, Trevor. Yeah, Appreciate thank you. you. Good luck this season. Yes. Go Atlas.